Hey there, Steve here. Hope you're doing well. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can easily achieve a Chica Nito tone like this. First, looking at the guitar, you're going to need something that preferably has strat style single coil pickups. And I'm going to be using my old trusty uh, PV generation guitar here. Telecaster shape, but has this uh, strat style configuration of pickups here. And the next thing you'll need to do is take your lead, plug one end into the guitar, and then the other end, you want to plug straight into your, no, not into your amplifier, but straight into your audio interface. Yes, I'm being serious. After this, you'll want to open up your digital audio workstation like I've done here. And um, I've got Chicanito's tone from that video that you saw in the intro there. And we're going to use this as a reference. So what you need to do first is you'll want to put in a compressor. So I'm just going to choose one here from Ableton, just a stock one that you get with it. Uh, next thing you want to do is add some EQ. His tone is quite bright, so we're going to go with this um, keys bright. Lastly, you'll want a big long ass reverb. So I'm going to go with this warm reverb that is known as long, but I don't want it to be too long. I'm going to bring it down to about three seconds. And obviously I don't want it to be 100% uh, the reverb signal, so I'm going to bring that down to a lovely uh, 30%. Anyway, for now. And the next step is to play something like a chica, which I'm sure you can do a better job than my um, half-baked idea that I'm going to record here. And when you're finally done, after one million takes, and you're happy with what you've just recorded, you can go ahead and compare the two. And the last step, most importantly, don't forget to cry at your feeble attempt. <laughs> oh, this is so much better than my fault. I could never play like that.